Well, you know that sound, you know it's Thursday, and Speedbusters is now hitting Hernando County for the first time. Leslie Lacey took her radar gun to Spring Hill, and the trip resulted in a new discovery. So what happened, Leslie? I'll tell you what, it definitely turned the tables here, folks. The people that you are about to meet live on a small dirt road called Orlando Avenue. Now, they are nervous about making a simple exit on Nepal Road. But this time, speeding is not on the ticket, and it has this speedbuster taking an unusual turn. Residents living across from Chokachati Elementary just want to leave their road safely. But it appears that many drivers don't know their left from their right when turning onto Powell Road. What, what is the problem that you're having right now? All right, what's happening is we have people coming out of uh, Nature Coast and Chokachati on the egress part on uh, Powell Road. Yeah. And they're, they're supposed to be making a right-hand turn only. Yeah. And they're making an illegal left turn. Now, the right turn sign is in clear view, but watch this. Drivers cross the median to turn left. What concerns you about it? What concerns me is I've had almost six head-on collisions due to that problem. The danger comes when Orlando Avenue residents want to turn onto Powell Road. We pull out at the same time. You know, I got the right of way, but if they decide they want to beat the traffic, I'm hit. I had one lady, I seen her little kid in the car, in the front seat. And she still did it, and we was like this. Both of us had to actually stop from hitting each other. You can to see one now. Look, you look. think he's gonna do it? Yeah. Oh, did. he did it. Did that it. that white car. I told you. You're um, right. This was brought to the attention of the sheriff's department numerous times. They bring a deputy. They sit him out on the corner. They won't do it. As soon as that deputy leaves, they constantly do it. And again and again, the illegal turning continues. Here we go. Right here. Yep. Ma'am, yep. hi. There's no. Ma'am, there's, there's another one. There's two in a row. Guys. This goes <laughs> on all day long. I spoke with the Hernando County Sheriff's spokesperson, Michael Terry. He told me that they are aware of the problem at Powell and Orlando, but they cannot promise me that the department would increase patrols there. However, he does say that it will remain an area of interest. And of course, I will be following up on this story. Can you imagine watching that over and yeah. over again? No, People it's just frustrating. Breaking off. Yeah, and, and you're, you're seeing it happen. And it's also dangerous because they're not expecting somebody to go the wrong way when they're turning out and they're almost crashing. Yeah. Can't I blame. can't believe that. Wow. All right. And if uh, somebody's got a problem with traffic, how do they get a hold of you? They go to my WFLA Leslie Facebook page. And you can also contact me on my Twitter account, and I'll bring speed busting to you.